Hey, this portion here, uh, like I mentioned, there are six to eight steps to find out the unknown. And of course, one of the few steps that you might encounter is the test of cation. And this part, I'm covering the white precipitate portion. So uh, sit back, watch and learn and see how I categorize it to help you better remember them, okay? Now we come to the white precipitate. So the, for the white precipitate, it's very simple. Under observation, for NaOH, upon adding NaOH, white PPT was observed. Like I said, you always add in excess. So in excess of NaOH, white PPT dissolve, giving a colorless solution. And this of because of this observation, it brings me to two cation. One of them is Zn2 plus, and another one is actually Pb2 plus. If you're doing pure chem, Al3 plus will occur over at this category as well. All right. Now, how do I differentiate these two then? Wow, very good. I'm glad you asked. Well, that's why NH4OH will come in. The observation will be this. For Zn2 plus over here, when you add NH4OH, the same thing will occur upon adding NH4OH, white PPT was observed. And in excess of NH4OH, white PPT dissolved, giving a colorless solution. That is Zn2+. However, if it's PP2+, it will be like this. Upon adding NH4OH, white PPT was observed in excess of NH4OH, white PPT, do not dissolve. Okay, that means that the white PPT is insoluble and this will actually bring me to PB2+. Now, there's one more that I want to bring in, which is upon adding NaOH white PPT was observed and in excess of NaOH white PPT do not dissolve. Yes, the keyword is do not dissolve. And who is this? Well, it's none other than my Ca2 plus. Calcium. Now, then you will ask, now how about calcium reaction with NH4OH? I'm glad you asked. For NH4OH, sometimes it's no visible reaction. That could be one possibility. Or slight PPT, slight white PPT observed. Only slight. So that is why it's very distinct. Alright, so let's recap again for the white one. When you add NaOH, white PPT observed in excess, they dissolve, giving a colorless solution. That will give you Zn2 plus and Pb2 plus. And how do you differentiate these two? When you use NH4OH. And NH4OH, only Zn2 plus will dissolve, giving a colorless solution. Where Pb2 plus under NH4OH, it do not dissolve. Then we go on to Ca2 plus over here. They will give you white PPT and the PPT do not dissolve in excess. And over under NH4OH, there's no visible reaction or slight white PPT observed only. I hope you get this. Hey, thank you so much for sitting through the entire test of cation. Upcoming, we have some more steps to actually sum up the entire practical series. So sit back, watch and look out for our new video, okay?